Hey guys! Welcome back to the channel, and today we've got something huge to talk about, Street Outlaws and Backstreet Racing in December 2024. Now, before we jump in, let me tell you something, this isn't just another rumor swirling around. This is the real deal. We've all heard the buzz, right? And just yesterday, Jeff Lutz confirmed it in an interview on the Street Outlaws live channel. That's right, street racing is coming back, and filming starts this December. Get ready, because it's going to be epic. Now, let's break this down. What's happening in December 2024? So, here's what we know. NPK, No Prep Kings, wraps up at the end of October 2024. That gives the Street Outlaws crew a little time to catch their breath, get the streetcars ready, and roll into what we're all hoping will be a street racing showdown for the ages. But, let's be clear here, it's not going to be on big tires. Nope. We're talking small tire street racing, and there are some pretty good reasons for that. Why small tires? Here's the thing, cars are getting crazy fast, and I mean insanely fast. We're talking about big tire cars that can run 420s on a good street. If that doesn't make your jaw drop, I don't know what will. But that kind of speed comes with a catch. It's dangerous. Like, really dangerous. And let's not forget, when Street Outlaws first started, back in Season 1 and Season 2, the fastest cars were running in the 470s and 480s on big tires. Fast forward to now, and we're basically talking about NPK-level cars running down the streets at speeds that push the limits of safety. Imagine this, you're flying down a street, pushing a beast of a car to its absolute limit. Back in 2021 and 2022, we heard stories, rumors if you will, of some racers running 14s. And when I say good concrete roads, I mean really, really good concrete. Ryan Martin, Jeff Lutz, and the crew? They were allegedly hitting those insane speeds. But think about it for a second, that's pure adrenaline mixed with pure danger. The dangers of big tires. Big tires on the street aren't just fast, they're risky. And not just risky in the ooh, you might spin out kind of way. We've seen some bad accidents, especially with small tires. And when it comes to big tires, the risks only go up. In fact, 2022 wasn't without its tragedies. Somebody tragically lost their life while filming Fastest in America, and it sent shockwaves through the community. Safety has to be a priority, and that's why I'm convinced, as Jeff Lutz hinted, that if Street Outlaws returns to street racing in December 2024, it's going to be small tire racing all the way. Small tires, not the same, but still cool. Now, don't get me wrong, small tires bring their own kind of excitement, but let's be honest, there's just something about a big tire car, right? The raw power, the roar of the engine, the sheer size of the tires tearing up the street. It's a spectacle. And while small tires don't pack quite the same punch visually, they bring something else to the table, competition. There's so much more competition when it comes to small tire racing. The playing field is a lot more level, and that means more exciting races, more head-to-head -head battles, and fewer blowouts where one car just runs away with it. Looking back at 2022 and what's coming next, if you look back at the last street racing event they filmed, Mega Cash Days, in December 2022, that was also on small tires. It was a killer show. There was action, there was drama, and those races were tight. But was it as cool as the big tire Mega Cash Days filmed during the pandemic in 2020? Well, I'll let you be the judge of that, but for me, nothing quite matches the sheer spectacle of those big tire beasts hitting the streets. And let's not forget about America's List. That show had some of the most intense street racing ever. The competition was fierce, the racers were pushing it to the edge, and every episode kept you glued to the screen. If we could get another season of that in 2024, along with this small tire street racing comeback, well, I don't know about you, but I'd be all in. So, what can we expect? We're on the edge of something big here, folks. December 2024 could mark the return of street racing in a way we haven't seen in a long time. Sure, we're not going to see those massive big tire cars tearing up the streets, but what we will see is some serious competition, tight races, and adrenaline pumping action. So, what do you think? Are you excited to see the small tire racers take to the streets? 
Do you think they'll bring back the intensity of those big tire races? Drop your thoughts in the comments below because I want to know what you think. If you're hyped about Street Outlaws coming back to street racing, make sure you hit that like button and don't forget to subscribe so you don't miss any updates on this December's events. We'll be following it all the way, bringing you the latest news, the most exciting moments, and maybe even some exclusive interviews with the racers themselves. Stay tuned, and we'll catch you in the next one.